Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Thanks for stopping by CJ's gaming channel. And today we are gonna look at something really cool. Um, I originally went to the retro game store in my town and I didn't really see any games that I wanted to pick up, but I did need a worm light. So I thought this was pretty cool. Now I can play my Game Boy Color in the dark. Um, here, I have this one here. I still need to peel off the screen. Um, protector but uh, let's see so let's see how this works very cool and now I can play in the dark so that's neat and I also was able to pick up something really cool too because I want to be able to start trading my games, uh, trading my Pokemon. So I have the silver in here. And I got one of these cords to be able to trade. I've never done this before. I've always seen my friends do it as kids back in the day. Um, but like I never actually traded myself unless it was in the game itself. You know how you can trade with those um, computer people, you know, they'll trade you like a, a Krabby for something really cool. Um, those are the only times I've ever actually traded. All right, finally. Ooh. This thing is really long too. So. Let that focus in. So here are two of the plugs and another one. So let's see how to do this. And I also brought my Mario Game Boy Color um, with Pokemon Gold in it. So let's see how to do this. Wow, that's so cool. So let's tra trade this Onyx and let's change Flaffy just for fun. I'm going to change them back, but, um, oops, didn't mean to click that. Trade. Oh my gosh, we're doing my first ever trade. This is so cool. Wow, very cool guys. So my first ever trade in the books. The link works, that was a lot of fun, that was really cool. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little trading session. And without further ado, I'm going to get into what I actually found too that was really neat, so stick around. You know, it's kind of funny. It's like, uh-oh, that awkward moment when you wear the same outfit to the same place. Hey. Yeah, what's up? What's the big idea? Who said you could wear this red hat? You think your ash catch him? Maybe. What's it to you, kid? We're the same age, kid. Okay, that's enough guys. So that was a really great pickup. 12 bucks in total for the little light and the trading cable. So thank you Colin for these. So guys, here I have my Game & Watch poster. And basically, so I bought this thing at Michael's. It's a regular poster, but I couldn't find anything that would fit. Like, I think it's like 26 by 26 or 36 by 36. It's a very specific size for game 
stock posters. Ooh, spider. Um, so basically I picked this up at Michael's and what I wanted to do was I wanted to spray paint the top and the bottom half so that way I could get um, some type of design with the Game & Watch poster. I think this is gonna look really cool. So Matt saw on TikTok um, this painting trend and we did it and actually here's like some examples of what we used to do. And we kind of wanted to do something along the lines of like this for that poster. So stay tuned and I'll show you what it looks like. Oh, and check the hat. We got, who we got on there? Raichu, Gyarados, and... Um, and who else? Water, water Pokemon. Who else is on it? Oh, War Turtle. Sure is. Mm hmm. Tried getting him on the Pokemon website, but yeah. he wasn't in our cart anymore. Okay, so this is kind of how it, how it is. And a little spray. You can kind of just splatter it like that. And my idea is it's going to look like a galaxy for the game watch poster. Matt. It's A1. Honestly, it pops. It does look like that little galaxy. I love the colors. And last up, we're going to do gold. So, give it like that extra shimmer. And take a look at the Game Watch poster we got over there. So, the background is actually gold itself, too. So, I think this is going to be really cool. Look at this one, Matt. This one's cool. It didn't end up as like a dot. This one is kind of like a, like a splatter. Yeah. Kind of like, that's cool. I like that. Yeah, that's money. Nice. I like the shimmer on it. <laughs> you know, that's like, this is what it looks like here, kind of. But I think you can kind of see the, we'll get some light on it and yeah, we'll show you what it looks like. Let's see if we can go back here maybe. Can you see it in the light? Not the time. A little bit. Yeah. Okay. There's a storm coming. Uh oh. Good. And Matt thought about a cool way to finish this poster. Instead of just doing the little splats, you kind of go over it as well so it like accents, which you already did. It's almost like a coating of the galaxies. Nice. I mean, honestly, there's no way that you can mess it up. It's just, it's a cool experiment other than just putting a poster in a poster board. So this is a really neat project. And uh, here's the unveiling. Alright guys, so here's the poster in its final resting place in my house. This thing turned out so awesome. You can see, see if you can see the glitter. There you go, you can see the gold right in there. It's looking so cool. And the Game & Watch poster. I'm really happy with the way it came out. Let me know if you guys like this. Give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. 
and say goodbye to our fans, Amelia. They're on a little bit of catnip right now. Tiggy, say goodbye. Yeah, he's a little busy. All right, guys. Thanks for watching another video. See you in the next one.